Today, I'm joined with Scrapman, and we're going to be doing a glider challenge where we're going to be launching a self-made glider off this catapult. And each round, we're actually going to be changing the gravity setting. So it's going to be interesting to see how our gliders are affected by the gravity. Sound good, Scrapman? Sounds good to me. All right, let's get building. All right. Okay, so let's get building our glider. 100 blocks is not a lot, but I mean, it's a glider. It's not that complex, right? Thing is, I want my glider to be light, but not too light. So I'm actually going to go with an odd width design. And I'm going to really utilize the aerodynamics here. Green arrows means good aerodynamics. All right, the main body and the fuselage is built. I'm pretty chuffed with that. I've only used 37 blocks, so I have enough for the wings and the tail. So let's just get to it. All right, some slight modifications. I got rid of the stubby nose on this and added this cooler one. It just looks way cooler. So I guess I can put some form into this, but now we can actually get onto the wings. Also guys, I should probably mention we're not allowed gyros or any like quantum rudders or anything. This is all purely traditional means of flight. So like the flap wings, the ailerons, all of those. You see how I have these red arrows here inside the build? That will not do. We need to fill that in. Quick update on the wings. Let me just show you so I can actually toggle different angles on the wings to affect the flying. I think if it's in a V formation like this, the wings will be a little bit more stable. I'm not sure if that's true, but we're going to test it out each round anyway. And now all I need to do is add the tail. Here we go. Ooh, what a launch. Oh, there's Scrapman over there. He's obviously testing too. And it feels okay. We're, we are a little front heavy. So I think I need to bring the wings forward a little bit if I can do that somehow. All right, some major improvements have been made. And wow, what a launch. It is a little bit more balanced out now. It definitely feels a lot more better to glide with. Wow. All I really need to do now is give this thing a paint job. Let's get to it. All right, Scrapman, have you finished your glider? Uh, yes, I have, but I, I feel pretty good about mine. Uh, but let's see yours. All right, so here's mine. Oh, this is small. <laughs> it's very for, small, yeah. For a 100 block limit, it's very small. <laughs> I didn't go for the total limit. Um, I wanted to be very light for this. Mm -hmm. So this is what I came up with. All right. How heavy, and, you, uh, how heavy are you? How heavy? I am 63.2 kg. That is very light. Like light. Very light. But also, I want to show you this little function it has. So when I press shift, ah. it will uh, give me some tilted wings, which will help with stability and hopefully keep the nose up. Okay, interesting. But yeah. All right. Well, my uh, mine weighs 400 kilograms. <laughs> oh. And this is mine. <laughs> Whoa. I built, wow. I built a kite. <laughs> it is a kite. Yeah. Um. So, yeah. I, I mean, it doesn't have any special functions. It's just got, you know, pitch and roll. And it, it glides. It's a glider. Oh, man. I'm very intimidated <laughs> by that. That is huge. <laughs> as soon as I started building, I was like, I think 100 blocks may have been too much, but let's put some lift in this thing. Wow. Yeah, I actually have a lot of weight okay. blocks in it because I, I, I started off a little bit too light. Well, two very different approaches. I went super light and you went super heavy. Yep. Heavy with lift. All right. Uh, so should we start at half a G and work our way up to 2G? Yep. All right. I think that sounds good. I feel like we could launch and then turn right and go as far as we can all right okay so we launch from this we try and do a hard right and then we just go in that direction and whoever goes the furthest wins that round yep all right why don't you go first okay no pressure yeah <laughs> okay so i'm in the build mode i'm actually gonna just drop my build on there and it will spawn me in my seat there it goes oh, oh a successful launch that's good trying to turn it and oh we're all right, he is like, oriented. Oh, man. Is this half a G? Oh, yeah, this, we're in half a G. I, almost, I actually forgot this immediately. This is half a G. Yeah. I am so light. <laughs> I feel like I'm in, like, space right now. That's true. I, I don't know how mine's going to fare in half a G. Oh, my camera is not following you very well all of a sudden. Oh, there we go. Oh, well, I'm not moving. This is not very exciting content right now. <laughs> <laughs> this might take a while in half a G. You're like, I can see you like trying to wow, go down. I'm super <laughs> unstable. I, yeah, I want to go down to just get some speed, I guess, and distance. I mean, wow, I am floaty. We still have a lot of altitude. Yeah, you got I'm a above long, the bridge level. You got a long way to go. <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. All right, you might be able to make it past the island here. 
So I'm going a measly 23 miles per hour right now. Interesting. Yeah, I'm curious how mine will perform in half a G. Oh, you're diving down. Yeah, I'm trying to keep a steep angle here so I can get some speed. Yeah, it's a balance between speed and altitude. Oh, we're, co we're coming close now. Yep. How much more distance can you squeeze out of this? I'm just trying to squeeze as much as I can. And uh, skimming uh, across the water. Look at that. It's just still yeah, gliding. Yeah. There we go. All right, I guess <laughs> hop out and just uh, keep your character there as a reference point. All right, scrap man, you're up. Uh, let's see if I can get a good launch here. Here we go. Oh, going for the oh. vertical takeoff. Uh oh. Yep. It uh -oh. was a little awkward, but I'm going in the right direction now. All right. Wait. Okay, you look a little speedy. I'm gonna check my settings. I mean, it feels like yeah, it is a half a G. That's weird. Uh, my settings in the bottom left say one G, but the actual settings are half a G. Um, I'm definitely slow. <laughs> I slowed <laughs> down a lot. I see your name Man, out you there. You got some real height though. You got some a lot. I think you're higher than me on the launch. Maybe. Well, my hood's off right now, so I don't actually know where I am in the ocean until oh, yeah. uh, you get close. Okay, well, you definitely made this a lot quicker than I did. You're going to about to pass the snow island, so. All right, you're 900 meters away now. You see me? Oh, I see you. Yep, I I'm see above you. you. He's coming in. Uh -oh. All right, this is looking good. Uh -oh. I, I can, oh, I can no. see a little speck of you down there. <laughs> your little ant. I think I'm passing right now. 200. There we go. Uh, yeah, now I'm going yeah, further that's, away. That's a pass. That is a pass. I don't I don't know if I want to finish this off to my maximum potential. <laughs> <laughs> you still got quite a bit to go. I, I do, mean, you could yeah. just dive. Yeah, here we go. I'm going to dive and then I'm going to glide as close as I can to the water. All right, diving. All right. Oh. Oh, oh look at that. Look at that. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, I Oh, I touched down. Okay, there we go. There we go. All right. Well, that was uh that was actually that went faster than I was expecting to for my plane. I thought I thought the zero G I might be a little bit too floaty, but that felt pretty good. I think my mass is helping me. All right, on the map here, we can see the distance he made compared to me. But I mean, we both went significantly past both islands. So yeah, I think we both did pretty well. All right, we're gonna bump it up to one G, and we're going to allow for modifications between rounds, but only the loser from the previous round gets to change their design. So that means you get to upgrade yours, and I got to keep mine the way it is. All right, I have made my modification. All right, what do you got here? I have opted for an actual powered tail fit to give me more drag. Interesting. I was expecting some more wings on this, but uh, hey, we'll, we'll see what happens. All right, Yuzi's going first again. 1G round. We'll see how far he can get this time. Okay, here we go. This is normal gravity. All right, he has launch. And he is zooming I up into the go. air. Okay, oh, that was a bit... Okay, we're whoa. having a little bit of a hiccup. Oh, oh you're whoa, losing control okay. a little bit. <laughs> All, All right, right. We're, we're back on track. Back on track, there he goes. Yeah, I can feel the, the how much faster you are on this. Yeah, we're zooming now, going about 55 miles per hour. Nice. If I keep it at this, this angle. All right, how far is he going to be able to get with this one? Yeah, you're definitely losing altitude a little bit quicker. Oh, I saw your, you did your wing thing. Yeah, I did my gl glider mode. Is there a noticeable impact on how it performs? I think it gives me sl a little bit more lift and keeps the nose up, but uh, it's only really for the heavier gravity. So mm. right now, not really a difference. Oh, can we just scrub past the oh, snow island? He's going. There he goes. All right, and touch down. Am. You are... 2058 meters is what i saw okay around 2060 all right here we go 1g oh good launch all right and uh -oh. off he goes turn that way i don't have momentum in the right direction this isn't good oh boy i lost a lot of altitude oh, there he's, all right he's there we go now okay there we go that was oh, awkward i was trying to figure out how to turn out of that vertical launch got a nice cruising speed of 85 miles per hour Ooh. Yeah, I feel like I have a higher altitude right now than you did here. I'm able to get over these rocks. Yeah, definitely higher than me. I think I was below the cliff, I think. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, this is feeling nice. I say I'm feeling pretty good about this design. I think I'm passing over you right about now. And there he goes. Way past me again. <laughs> yep. All right. Wow. All right, I'm getting really close to the water now. Pulling up. 
Trying to avoid the waves. Oh, oh, I just skimmed off of a wave. <laughs> <laughs> it pushed me up. Oh, there we go. And I am down at 4,100. Right. All right. We're, okay. we're moving on to 1.5G. And Yuzi can make whatever modifications he wants within the 100 block limit. Okay. More upgrades have been made, giving me a little bit more vertical drag. Here we go. Whoa. Ooh. That was a powerful launch. Oh man, I feel I feel the gravity. Wow. Yeah, 1.5 G now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, you are going down quick. fast. Oh. We are losing altitude. Wow. Holy moly. That's a big difference. All right. I can see uh, style mode has been activated. Oh man, I don't even. I don't. Oh, I'm gonna no. land on the island here. Scrap. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh man. Oh boy. Wow, it's a there huge it step up. That it's is a, a huge much difference. bigger difference than I was expecting. Wow. 1195, round that up to 1200 if I walk back towards the, the spawn point. All right. All you scrap. All right, here we go. 1.5G. Ooh, man, your launches are always so good. Okay, here we go. Turn it in the direction I need to go. I see you down there 1200 meters away. Oh, I'm feeling good uh, about that's... this. Wow. I'm over 100, 110 miles per hour. This is gliding. Oh, yeah. And that's me down <laughs> <My there. Uzi. laughs> I honestly kind of feel like not pressing anything might actually be better. Is this just like a default glide? No input? Yeah, right now I'm doing nothing. Wow, look at that. I passed the, the double point of your distance. <laughs> I'm trying to pitch up a little bit at the last second here. Get some altitude. Oh, uh, oh, uh, fighting it. And there it is. There it is. Nice. All right. Okay. Go ahead and spawn back up there. I want to know what this final one is. 3390. Huh. Yep. That's like almost a thousand meters less than I got on the 1G one. All right. I added more lift. Let's go for this 2G round. Good luck. Three, two, one. Oh, holy Line drive. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, careful. Uh oh. Oh, there he goes. Okay. I activated my uh, glider mode wow. for this heavy it's so, this, gravity. This almost feels more realistic in a way. Like watching you, I'm like, yeah, this is what gliders look like. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so much more fast paced. Look how quick I'm losing altitude. This is like, even with that extra lift. Yeah. You know what? You're. Like you're not that far away from your last uh, point. Yeah. So that, I think that's actually not too bad compared to your 1.5 G performance. All right. So you are um, 1,046 meters away from the spawn point. I have not tried this thing in 2 G at all. You ready? I'm ready. I'm just gonna stay down here and watch you. All right. I feel like the launch could make or break this. Let's see what happens. There we there go. He goes. Oh, I feel good about that. I can see him. He's a tiny speck. Oh, okay. That turn was good. I can tell. Oh, yeah. All right. Now I'm feeling good about How it. How does it feel? Oh, this feels nice. Oh, you're going to swoop wow. past me again. Oh, this Look feels at that. good. Once it, once I got straight and level, it's really stable, really steady. 130 mile per hour, climbing a little wow. bit. I might still be able to make it past the, the snow island. Oh, it's close. Ooh, it's close. I think... Oh, I think I'm just getting past it. Yeah, you're oh, definitely past it. And there it is. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Oh, okay. Nice. Definitely a lot lot less distance with the 2G, but still feeling pretty good about my design. 2400. Right. Yeah, I, I lose like almost a thousand meters every uh, every gravity difference, it looks like. Definitely made the optimal glider today, Scrap Man. Alrighty, well, there you have it, guys. Glider challenge with variable gravity settings. Definitely leave your suggestion on what you want to see us do next. And whilst you're at it, why not consider subscribing? It's free. But anyway, that's enough from me, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!